Because you seem calm. Last I year. I care so much that you said the kid was fake yawning. Because you last year you seemed to have an obsession with the word fake last year, I noticed. That was in your head a lot, but it seemed to have gone. I know, Nicholas. Now you're obsessing about me having a, a word called fake. Why would you say Mr. Beast is fake in his videos and crap? You don't know that. I didn't say that. Was that what I just explained to you. He dramatizes them up, makes them interesting so people watch them. He does not fake yawn. Gee. How dare you bring that up last year? Because you know you wanted a reaction of me. You were looking for a reaction. Are you being serious right now? How dare I bring up that he was fake yawning last year? Because you were looking for a reaction. You wanted me I to... I was not looking for a reaction. You were looking for a reaction by showing me the stupid video over and over again. And you got one. And you're still saying it a year later. It's nuts. Because you seem to say it was fake. You I said, don't care about you said, a kid reading something for five hours, Nicholas. It's dumb! You said nurses are fake people sometimes? Okay. School doesn't care about when you talk about Ireland all day long? Mr. Beast fakes his yawns for views and crap like that? Okay. I don't care what you talk about. See, I, I, I must, I'm just not allowed to talk to you. Because a year later, you'll switch to your, your mind. And it's just crazy, crazy. Remember those things, and you're able to turn. It's them ridiculous around. for you to say that. Why did you see he was thinking yawning? Oh my god! I'm gonna stop drinking water because you said that a year ago. Nuts. Yeah, you seem to have an obsession with the word fake for some reason. The word F A K E, fake. I get it, I get it, Nicholas. I have an obsession with the You word said fake. that security guard. Get over guard. my obsession. No. Because I don't care no. about your opinion of Now you're bringing up the word drink of water. Seriously? The security guard that said he wanted to give you a ride probably doesn't have kids, Nicholas. Mari. I never said that, Nicholas. You said sometimes predators would exactly, fake that they have children. Exactly, Nicholas. That's different. The devil is in the details. That's what you were cut. You leave them out to become the devil. That's leave what you... out the details in terms of the devil. You said the security guard doesn't have kids. No, Nicholas. I said sometimes people pretend they don't have kids to get parents to trust them. That's also That's right. totally different than saying the security doesn't have kids. Totally different. You take out the two words that you want to take out and change the whole sentence to say, security guy doesn't have kids, he's lying. I haven't said that. I said sometimes people trick parents by telling them they have kids too. They strike up a conversation, oh, I have kids too. Wee, wee, wee. That's how they trick people. Just like the Walgreens thing. That's what I said whenever the fuck I said it, and it's irrelevant today. You're changing the lesson you learn that people actually trick people. The Walgreens things, pedophiles, they trick people by saying what they want, what the people, what they think the people want to hear. You're changing it ten years later, five years later, a year later, into something else. And it's an obsession of weirdness. You change the whole thing. To justify crap. I lie all the time. I lie all the time. Now he's going to switch to this. You lie all the time. I lie all the time. Me. I know you do. Name stuff and I lied about. I just did. I said the security guard doesn't have kids. You just did it. I never said that, Nicholas. I said sometimes people say they don't have, they have kids. To tr trick the parents. That's what I said. Then, you just lied about it. Then the guy's a psycho. I didn't have to think hard, did I? Because you just did it three seconds ago. The guy's a psycho, then. No, Nicholas. I didn't say that. What if he actually doesn't have kids? And what if he is a then predator? Then he would be a psycho. Yeah. Your father's a scumbag for not being over here right now. Yeah, yeah. What you said to Eric in that car. For no reason. For no reason? 
Because that's not what Eric told me. He said your father would be upset about the environments you're being in. And he should be here right now. No, he never said that. Do you still have the video? We're not even going to watch it. But I remember him saying, your father, if he knew the environments you would be in, and he would be upset and mad. And he knows, and he is upset and mad. That's why he said he shouldn't go over Tom's anymore. He never said your father's a scumbag queen over here, so you lied, technically. You gonna like the answer? You gonna freak out over the answer? What answer? I said you lied about that, because that's what Eric never it said. It wasn't a lie, Nick. I was expressing my opinion on how Eric talks about to, to a kid. And you and sometimes he he says bad things about him, like me to you. Like why would you do that? Oh yeah, when he brought up about the heroin mm. that you invited a guy over to your house and did heroin? Yeah, Eric tells me that every time. Aaron invited this guy over to my house in San Francisco. I don't want to talk about it. He it's tells stupid. me every time. I don't care. I do not care what people tell you anymore, Nichols. It's junk. Some people, especially when they're emotionally... You seem to have very... Like you. you seem to have very bad mood swings. Really? Yeah, you do. I noticed. You do. That's something new I've mentioned. Is that old to you or new? It's because of this house. I can never sleep. I have to do what you tell me. It's nuts. You have a mood to this. Everybody does. Nobody, uh, tries to do it. Well, I'm gonna have to talk to the water and expect this kid not to get in a bad mood. That's what you're trying to do is put someone in a bad mood. And then you're gonna accuse them of having mood swings. Nuts. Why do you keep bringing up the word drink water? Because that put me in a bad mood, Nicholas. That's a mood swing. You caused my mood to swing. Why do you keep bringing depressed. that up, though? The quit drinking water crap. I'm not talking because about that. Because you said I had mood swings. I'm explaining to you what swung my mood from happy to sad. You. I'm not. What do you. I am drinking water. Nicholas, for the last. Ow, we've been talking you've been talking about not drinking water, and now you're switching it to drinking water. That is gonna swing people's moods. There's causes for people to swing. You're doing it. You're trying to make people sad when they're happy. You have mood swings. No, you just can't I was happy and you made me sad. That's not a mood swing. Man, what has my life turned into, huh? What has it turned into? You gonna be sarcastic? For what? No, Nichols. What has my I'm life turned into? Obvious. What has Stop my life saying that? What is my idiot. What has my life turned into? My life turned into what is my life turned into? It's not even what? It's called Meredith, my friend. It's called McDonald's. You go to McDonald's. Oh, oh, oh. Cause Marek is my friend. Repeating the, the crap you're saying, Nicholas. What? It's Who cares if Mark's your friend? I don't give a fuck. Wow. W O W. Wow. Go tell the people at McDonald's that Mark's your friend. <sighs> then you bring up the trampoline all the time for some reason. I haven't brought that up in like one month. That's still in your head? I should be dragging you and throwing you in the water. That would stop the trampoline talk. Oh, really? Yes. You should grab me out the bed when I'm rolling around in clothes. Exactly. Same thing. I don't even do that. What the hell? You're lying, right? You're just kidding. No, I did do that, but I don't do it anymore. No, I was saying he's my friend. I know he is. Hopefully he is. Hopefully he's not using me. Not this in your... Is, this is such a waste of time. It's ridiculous. We've been standing here for an hour talking about crap. Hopefully he is.
But I bet you he isn't because of what I said on TikTok. You don't be friends with people like that. What? There you go, exactly. I said, holy mackerel. <sighs> Who gives a fuck? Really? Yeah, nobody cares if Matt was stealing your friend there. Nobody cares if the kid was ducked out of the trampoline. Nobody cares. Talk about something that people care about, like... Let's go check out the game, and then we'll go to McDonald's. Is that cool, Aaron? No, that's not cool. That's stupid what you say. Why is that stupid? Because if I said we'll go to McDonald's after we check out that fun game you suggested, we'll go to McDonald's together, you'll say, no, I don't want to go to McDonald's because you're ordering me to. No, I wouldn't. Yes, you would you say that. If you asked me to go, if you asked me to go rather than say, telling me I'm going, it would be different. No, I... I know, we, no, actually, we've been talking for an hour, an hour. Exactly, and I said that an hour ago. I'm not going to McDonald's on your orders. You ask me to go. Aaron, would you, would you like to go to McDonald's? We'll stop at that thing just to check it out real quick. On our little ride. We'll come back. It's a simple little thing. No, I'm not going to McDonald's because you ordered me to. Exactly. But how did I order you to if I brought up the rugby first? What, how did you bring up the rugby first? If, if we went back to the past one hour ago and I decided not to bring up we'll go to McDonald's and I said we'll go, we should go to McDonald's after we watch the rugby first. Yeah, that's, that's, would be, that would be a normal thing. But you didn't do that. You said, we're going to McDonald's, Aaron. I said, yeah? Yeah, we're going to McDonald's. No, I'm not going to McDonald's. That's an order. I'm not taking orders to go to McDonald's from you. You're not even asking. You're telling me I'm going. Big difference from telling someone they're going to McDonald's and asking them to go to McDonald's. Then also last year you used to bring up whoever wrote it. That was nuts also. Exactly. Next time you next time you next time you want to go to McDonald's with somebody, Nicholas, write a little script. How do I get someone to go to McDonald's with me? I say, will you go to McDonald's with me? Not, we're going to McDonald's. Big difference. We're going to McDonald's, Aaron. You're coming with me. Aaron, would you like to go to McDonald's with me? It's a big difference in that sentence, Nicholas. Big difference. The videos you watch are all scripted and written, Nicholas. And all fake. That's what last year Aaron said. Last year Aaron used to say, Mr. Beast faked his yawns and crap. What you watch for Mario... Go back to that again, Nick. Go yeah. back to that again. I did not say he's faking his yawns. I said he's possibly faking his yawns to make the video interesting. So I should have watching. filmed you saying it then. Holy mackerel. It doesn't matter, Nicholas. It's a yawn. It's a, it's a subject that's stupid. Aaron said he's faking his yawns. Oh my God, I'm going to talk about this a year from now. Aaron said he's faking his yawns. Aaron said he's faking his yawns. Aaron said he's faking his yawns. I quit water. What? Why the heck are you going berserk? Because that's what you're doing by say I'm I'm content I'm I'm copying you. That's what you're saying by me saying it. Uh, Aaron said he faked his yawns a year ago. You're berserk. That's berserk saying that. Who was it yelling? Because I was copying you. I'm not yelling. You're telling me that this kid is that I said he's faking his yawns. Who cares what I said about some kid faking his yawns? You should care. Well, I don't. Because it's stupid. Then you should have kept it a bubble thought then. You should have said, if I say this, Nicholas, no, Nicholas yeah. I can't say anything around you. That's what it comes down to, because you switch it. And you, you obsess on it. Now, when I met you at four years old, did I ever behave like this at four years old? Be honest, uh, did I? No, Nicholas, you couldn't talk. Four-year-olds can talk. No, you couldn't. Now, wow, now you're saying I have no voice. That's very disrespectful. 
<laughs> Why are you laughing? Be mad. I just said I have no voice. You just said I have no voice. You Why guys... are you acting like this when you were four? Was a stupid question. Was I obsessed with a trampoline then? No idea. Don't remember what you were doing then. I'm sure it was um, anything you wanted. When I had an ammonia? It was anything you wanted to do. You Whatever took... you wanted to do. Guess if what? If you wanted to play in the trampoline and kick people, <laughs> it's okay. If you wanted to roll around your bed, it's okay. Slap people when they disrespect me? If you want to talk about this crap for hours, it's okay. So I'm pretty sure it was similar stuff. When I had a pneumonia, you took me to the hospital, right? If I had one now, you won't take me to the hospital. Taking twenty <coughs> seconds. To answer. <coughs> it's taken twenty seconds to answer that. I'm ignoring you from now on because it's just gonna go on and on and on and on. You wouldn't take me to the hospital if I had pneumonia, huh, Aaron? You wouldn't do it, would you? Yes, I would, Nicholas. Oh my God! He's being sarcastic. He really wouldn't. Well, here we go again. It just goes on and on, Nicholas. This is dumb. So I'm gonna ignore you. I hate my life. There you go. I do. I hate mine. I more do. More than you. Please. No, I actually hate my life more than you. I Wait. hate my life more! No, I actually do. I actually do. No, I actually no, do. No, I do. I hate my life more than you. Let's join a club about hating lives. I miss Ireland. I got nothing to do, I'm depressed every day, so my life sucks way more than yours. Because you didn't get to deal with that. How much money do you have? 20? How much money do I have? I have 20 bucks. Yes. I mean, I, the rugby's probably over by now anyway. Screw my life. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye.